G'day guys, how's it going? It is Jared HD here. Welcome to episode number 5 of season 1 of the FIFA 16 Her the Berlin Career Mode series. If you do go on to enjoy today's episode, make sure that you leave a like on the video. If we can hit over 120 likes, that would be fantastic. Also, make sure that you do subscribe to the channel if you are new around here. We are posting career mode content every single day. But let's not waste any more time. Let's get into today's episode. So we will start things off here with a little bit of training. So we're going to have Shima, Visor, Stark, Brooks and Kraft being put through their paces. And my question of the day today, fellas, is for the January transfer window, as Visor's going up there, for the January transfer window my main two targets are to buy a new striker and potentially a new goalkeeper so the question of the day is what goalkeeper and what strikers should I look at buying leave them in the comment section down below and I will add those players to my shortlist Ah, crap, fellas. Valentine Stocker, our center attacking midfielder, has suffered a concussion whilst on international duty for Switzerland three weeks on the sidelines for the influential midfielder. But anyways, we have a big matchup here away from home against Schalke. Let's get into it. So we are traveling to the Veltons Arena here for the opening matchup in today's episode. It is a big challenge for us. We are taking on Schalke. Here is the Bundesliga standings right now. Schalke are top of the table, which is crazy to see. We are down in 14th position. Three points is going to be difficult, but it is definitely going to be needed. Here is the Schalke lineup for this matchup. So Joel Matip and Benedict Howardes are the center backs. Class Jan Huntela and Moting Leroy Sane, Sydney Sam, very decent side. And then here is our lineup for this matchup. So it is a pretty strong side. Junozovic slotting into Cam to replace Stocker. Darida and Hegelar are our centre midfielders. Plattenhardt comes back into the starting 11. Same with Brooks. Schalke on the attack. It goes to Hogar, who goes to Moting. They hit it, but it's well wide. Huntela crossing that one. It goes out. No, surely he's offside. What? I thought Chupo Moting was offside. But anyhow, how was he so far open? Where was our defense? I swear, looking at this replay, who was there? Who was meant to be marking him? Plattenhart was meant to be marking him. Wow. One nil down, and that was just poor defense. Substitution coming here. So we're taking off Hegler, who has been very, very poor in this game. Bringing on Nicholas Stark because I feel like we're, we're getting really good opportunities. You guys don't see it because we're getting in on goal. But the last pass is just going astray. I swear the passing on this game is just, in general, just so broken. Here we go. Ibezevic through to Yonezovic. Why would you leave that? <sighs> he goes there. Short. Go again. Wrong person. Anywho. Plattenhart. He's running up the line. Go on, Plattenhart. Has the strike. Plattenhart. Oh, he scores the goal. Plattenhart scores it. Our first real shot on goal. And our left back, Plattenhart, ties this game up. We just ran across the side of the goal. Thank you, B-Monus Gamer, for that trick. He taught me that if you just run sideways, the defense can't stop you. You hit that one. What a goal. One all. Can we push for a winner? Goes there to Dorita. Ah, full time. We're on a good attack, but that's full time there. I am satisfied with that. A point against Schalke is a good result. We left it late, and in all honesty, we were the better team in this game. We just couldn't thread our final passes together. Promising signs, one all draw against the league-leading Schalke. All right, so another training session here. This time, we have Visor, Sainsbury, Brooks, Dorita, and Scheiber putting the training boots on here we go how do they go and C's and D's all around the shop going up a little bit there visor and Shiva, but all around a pretty average session we're gonna go here and offer Ibezevich a new contract I plan on possibly selling him in January but 
I'm just going to offer him a new contract just to make sure he doesn't leave on a free. The second matchup in today's episode, we are on the road once again, taking on Matthew Leckie, the Australian side, FC Ingolstadt. Taking a look at the Bundesliga stand. No, it's not. Okay, they've cut that out now. So, anyways, here is the Ingolstadt lineup. No Matt Leckie in the starting 11. Don't recognize too many of the players, to be fair. Morales is probably the only one that I actually recognize. But anyways, here is our lineup. We're rocking a very strong side once again, mainly because Ingolstadt are only just ahead of us on the table. So, a win here will see us overtake them, which would be fantastic. Here we go, Yunusovic. Short there to Stark. Stark's going to have the long shot. Oh, save. That would have been an awesome start to the game. So an early corner here. Yunusovic to whip this one in. It goes to Brooks. Brooks with the header, but he misses. Here we go, Shaiba. Playing that one through. Ben hatira has got the pace. Holding it up. He's got a bit of space. Finesse's Oh, we've got the lead. What a start to the game it has been. You couldn't imagine a more perfect start. A struggling side like us getting a 1-0 lead seven minutes into the game against a fellow relegation potential scrapper. They're attacking here, Ingolstadt. Ah, oh, they get past our defender. They square it and they fucking equalize. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Four minutes we have the lead. Ah. Oh, how didn't Kraft even get to that one? Far out, lads. Not happy about that. Visor, Ben Hatira goes back there to Yunusovic. Playing it short to Dorita, out to Shiba. Can we get the goal back? Save, get the Shiba, yes! We've got the lead again! What a game this has been! 2-1 up, 13 minutes into this game. Holy shit, this is end-to-end -end stuff. When I got the rebound off this, I thought I didn't put enough on it, but luckily the goalkeeper just stood there and watched. Oh, well tackled from Plattenhart. Now can we hit him on the counter-attack? He's running up the line, he plays it through to Ben Hatira going to hold it. He gets past one. He's having a blinder of a game. Passing that one. Dorita hits it. Oh, what a save. That could have been 3-1. So I've got another corner here. We whip this one in. It goes to Visor. Goes back out. Hit it, Ben Hatira. He hits it. Oh, what a goal. Ben Hatira making a 3-1. Where has this come from? We've almost doubled our goal tally for the season in the first 20 minutes of this game. Holy moly, what a finish, Ben Hatira being the best player so far today, off the chest, on the volley, take a bow son. Oh, tackled from Dorita, where is this coming from? A spark has been lit, Ben Hatira, through there, Dorita, back, Yunusovic, he hits it, oh man, we are playing with so much confidence. Ingolstadt running up the line. They cross it, get it away. No, they get a header on. Holy shit, we are so bad at defending headers. He's running, playing that one through there to our right back. It goes back out to Holweiser though. He's got the pace to burn. He's going to cross it, low cross, deflected, hit. No, what a miss. That could have been 4-1. What a miss, Ben Hatira. Here we go. Can we get another goal before halftime? Ben Hatira holding it up. He gets past that defender there. He's going to cross this one in. It goes in there. Shiba! Oh, no, he misses the header. Oh, what a first half it has been. Probably the most entertaining first half I've played this year on FIFA. Full stop. This entire FIFA. That man there. And he's Ben Hatira. You are the real MVP. Corner here for Ingles start in the 50th minute. Let's keep them out, fellas. See the guy on the back post. Get rid of it. Oh, no. Oh, where was our defense? Oh, falls perfectly for Ben Hatira. What's he going to do? He passes it. Hit it. Dorita makes it 4-1. Surely that's going to be the three points. What a game this has been. We are all over them. A common mistake there from the Ingolstadt defenders. Great vision. Great finish. 4-1. Balmahan playing this one through. Go on, Shiba. Bit of a push in the back there. Bit of a tug on him. He's going to cross it across goals. Get there. Back post. Hits it. Saved. Get the rebound. That's going to be 5-1. What a time to be alive. 5-1. Yes. Full time, fellas. And what a turnaround this game is. I don't know whether it was the quality of opposition that we were playing. Whether I've gotten used to the players and understand how to best utilize them. 
Uh, I, I can guarantee I'm not using sliders, or I, I'm still playing on world class because I still want that challenge, and I think that was evident from the goal that we conceded, but... That was just amazing, some amazing goals, and Ben Hatira, by far the best player on the team today, absolutely stoked with that result, 5-1 against SC Ingolstadt. So our two monthly scouting updates have come here, let's check out the first one, the Croatian scout report, that fella's looking alright, we're going to deny that guy there, deny him, he's gone down obviously, he's looking alright. Few decent players. I just keep them around to continue scouting them whilst they have potential that is above the 80s. So a few high 90s guys. Danilo Jelicic looking decent, and so is Vukovic. So we'll continue to scout these fellas. And then for the other scouting report, it is the German scouting report. We'll deny him. Deny him. Keep looking at him, keep looking at him, keep looking at him, keep looking. He's looking alright, and deny him. So, a few decent prospects. And for the third training session in today's episode, we have Scheiber doing keep possession, Visor on Beat Your Man, Nicholas Stark on our Ronda. He looks like he could go up a fair bit. Same with Sigursi, who's doing Beat Your Man. He looks like he could get to a 75. And then John Anthony Brooks is doing El Rondo. So, as we simulate here, let's see how the fellas perform. No one going up in overalls, but still a decent training session. Sigursi, man, look at that. On the edge of a 75. Good news as well as Vedad Ebisevic Ibisevic, <laughs> accepts our contract offer. That means he won't be leaving on a free in January. On the road once again for the final matchup in today's episode. This time it is our opening match and hopefully not our last match in the Dusha Pokal, the German Cup. We are travelling and taking on Kaiserslautern. Hopefully we can go on a decent cup run, but... As you will see by looking at my lineup, I'm not overly fussed with how we go in this tournament. Here is the Kaiserslautern lineup anyways. Who do they used to have? I swear they used to have, I think they had Esvine or someone that was amazing in Ultimate Team back in the day. I uh, don't recognize too many of the players. I am pretty sure they are a second division side, always bouncing between the divisions. And then here is our lineup. And as you can see, it is a very rotational lineup. A couple of bigger players in there like Kraft and Kalu, but then a lot of rotational ones. Intercepted, Vandenberg. Playing that one up to Kurt. What's Kurt going to do? He gets past one, gets past two. Passing that one. Sigursi hits it! Oh, the Turkish midfielder almost scoring. Ooh, to Ronnie. Here we go. Playing that one through. Come on, Kalu. What's he going to do? Cutting around. He's going to play it through. Hit it, Ronnie. Ronnie hits it. Ah, oh, the Brazilian just misses. They're running up the line. Defend this one. Let's not go behind before half time. It goes in there. They're passing it around to us. Oh, my God. We are lucky not to be behind there. They, are pa they were just passing it and running us around in rings. Luckily, it's rainy, and luckily, they're a shit team. Passes it to Solomon Kalu. What's he going to do? Goes to Sigursi. Through there. Come on, Kurt. Surely he's the onside. He hits it. It's saved. And he was onside. That is a big opportunity blown. So a corner here for Kaiser Slaughter. And about 20 minutes to play in this game. They whip it in. They get the header, but it's straight at Kraft. Beerens. Kalu. Through to Ronnie. Here we go, Ronnie. Can he win it for us? Finesses it. Oh, he missed it. Oh, you did everything right, Ronnie, and then you miss it. How many times have you done that in this game? Ah, that was poor. Now we're in stoppage time. $100 says they score. No, save from Kraft. Thank God he saved that one. So that is full-time, fellas. I'm not sure if that's full-time completely or if we go into extra time now. I feel like we go into extra time. Could be a replay. We'll see here. And... We're going into extra time, okay. Intercepted here. Can we hit him on the counter-attack? Bomahan. He made, made, made the wrong, ra wrong run, mate. Bomahan keeps going, though. He's cutting around. Go on, Bomahan. He's got a bit of pace. He hits it. Ah, oh, straight up Muller. No, they're one-on-one. -on -one. Save it. What a save from Kraft. Oh, in the 120th minute, Kraft makes a crucial save. Corner here. We need to get this out, then we're going to penalty shootouts. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. No, they score an own goal. Was that an own goal? Holy shit. 
We were open. I was aiming it out. Ah, oh, ah. Oh. We've just gone and scored an own goal in the 120th minute. You're kidding me. What happened? It was our own player. What are you trying to achieve? What was that? I can't believe this. Oh, fuck. I can't believe you've done this. Full time, fellas. We are eliminated from the Dusha Pokal, the German Cup in the first round. Heartbreaking loss. I don't really care about this tournament, but we went all the way to the 120th minute. It would have been nice to proceed. Frustrating as heck. 1 0 loss. Stupid own goal. What a way to wrap up what has been an action-packed episode of the Hertha Berlin Career Mode series. If you enjoyed episode number 5 of season 1, make sure that you leave a like on the video. As I said earlier, if we can hit 125 likes, that would be fantastic. Make sure that you do subscribe to the channel if you are new around here. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. The links, as per normal, will be in the description down below. But most importantly, fellas, I hope you have a fantastic day. It has been Jared HD here. I'm out. Peace. Bruh.